Okay, here we are at the end of the Union Players um, turn three. Um, not much happened. They merely solidified their lines here. Um, there was attack on the uh, extended Confederate uh, nine nine strength point unit here. Uh, using the new or using the variant rules for the Elau um, um, variant for the Napoleon at War series, um, which I thought I'd go ahead and try um, since it's a pretty low density counter density and stuff. Um, basically, the attack was a 1 1, so he takes one hit. His strength, his effective strength now is 8. And I had a cavalry unit stacked here with the artillery unit. Um, I'm still not crazy about our um, cavalry attacking with uh, infantry, but went ahead and allowed it. I'm just going to try and, and avoid stacking cavalry and infantry together. Anyway, there was just one strength point artillery in it, and it is now eliminated. So that's where we stand at the moment. It's going to be the Confederate turn three next. Okay, here we are at the uh, end of game turn three after Confederate movement and combat. It was not a pleasant turn for the Confederates. Um, they made a little bit of headway down here. They um, forced the elimination of an artillery unit of the Union and pushed his cavalry unit back. And they advanced uh, one of their infantry units there. But I think they took a step loss in their artillery. So. That wasn't um, too bad of an attack, but up along here, let's see here, I keep my camera from falling over. We'll kind of start towards the north, I guess. I'll get a different picture here, get it focused. And let's see. Um, I didn't resolve this attack up here. Well, I still have to resolve this attack. Anyway, um, there was a big attack on these two Union units here by this stack. This stack was, uh, each took, a, well, they took a hit and were forced to retreat and disrupt. So they're basically going to be out of the game until the first night uh, night turn, which is still about four turns away. And then we had an attack here where he had, this stack of uh, Confederates had to attack, let's see, I guess just that stack and I think this artillery unit. The other attack was just against that. Anyway, there were two one-to-one -one attacks. Um, this one just took a hit on both uh, the Union and the Confederate, so it was kind of a kind of a wash there. But um, Confederates got kind of a bloody nose this turn, so we'll see what happens in the uh, next video uh, when we go to turn four. All right, I think that's it for now.